So, what's up, y'all? Today, I had to hit for my macros. Sorry about that. Knock this stuff over. <clears throat> so, for my macros today, I had to hit um, 42.9 grams of fats. I had to hit 225.4 grams of carbs. And I had to hit 161 grams of protein. And I'm going to show you how I did it. So, some of this stuff... Y'all might think it's crazy that I'm even eating it. Like, the cereal and all of that, and Pop-Tarts, and it's also ice cream. I'll grab it out of the refrigerator, well, out the freezer. But, yeah, I eat that stuff, and I always eat that stuff, and you can eat that stuff if you learn how to track your macros. All right, so for breakfast, um, I actually ate breakfast twice today, technically. But for breakfast, I ate some of these, some Pops. Pop cereal, I ate two servings of it, which was um, two servings of those Pops. On the macros were zero grams of fat, um, 18 grams of carbs, and less than one gram of protein. So I didn't even count the protein. And this silk milk. Boom. I like this silk milk because it's really low in fat. What people don't realize is that everyone says, yeah, milk is a great source of protein, which it is, but it's also a great source of fat, and you also have to realize that it has the same amount of fat as it has protein if you're eating or well, if you're drinking whole milk, and then it has more carbs than anything else. So, on that silk milk, 1.5 grams of fat, 7 grams of carbs, and 6 grams of protein for one serving, which is one serving of liquid. Usually it's the same thing, which is 240 grams. I meant 240, yeah, grams. It says milliliters, but milliliters and grams are the same thing. Um, I had to get some quick carbs in because I went to the gym early this morning. So I ate that and I ate one of these, just one. Not They come two in the package, but I only ate one because one of them is, dun, 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 the macros on this, and this is, by the way, low-fat strawberry Pop-Tarts. Macros on this are 2.5 fats, 38 grams of carbohydrates, and 6, no, 2 grams of protein. Um, it was a quick way to get some carbs in. You need carbs for energy, so I use that for my energy so that I can have a productive workout. I work my shoulders today, by the way. I hope they look good. All right, so after that... I ate um, some grits. I eat grits every morning. Grits are my staple, and grits make me feel satiated longer. So I feel full longer when I eat grits. When I eat oatmeal, not so much. So I usually sway away from oatmeal. One serving of that with um, some egg whites in it. And then after that, I ate one of these. So these smoked turkey franks, they're fat free. I always get them, they're my favorites. They're fat free. So the. Um, the macros on it is zero fat, of course, because it's fat free. And then we have five grams of carbs and six grams of protein. So it's mainly protein. Um, I like them. I usually put some nonstick spray on the pan and I, you know, let them sit for a little while, brown up a little bit. And I'll show you guys how to do that in later videos. But today is just to show you what I ate. So then I ate um, with that hot dog or Frank or whatever you want to call it. I ate one of these, so fat-free cheese, which is mainly protein. It's um, two grams of carbs, two grams, four grams of protein, no fat, real easy. And then I ate one of these on the hot dog, so it was all together. I eat it all the time. I like it, and I'll show you guys. So this turkey bacon, if anybody eats bacon, you know that bacon has no carbs in it, but it's mostly fat. So I use bacon for my fats. Um, 2.5 grams of fats, 2 grams of protein. After that, what did I eat? After that, I ate, um, hold on one moment. Let me change the computer so I can see what I ate. Okay, so after that, I ate um, one serving of chicken breast, which is 112 grams. That comes out to 23 grams of protein, 2.5 grams of fats, no carbs. And then I ate... Um, 170 grams of white potato, just a regular potato. Put it in the microwave for a little bit. I'll show you guys in later videos how to, you know, pull that off. But 170 grams of 
potato and then I ate this. This is just a vegetable blend and it was good for me to get some micronutrients in there because I always talk about macros but micros are the vitamins and the, the minerals that you need inside of your body in order for your organs to work properly and um, that's how I got them for today. I ate the whole the whole little box which came out to dun, 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 220 grams total for 6 grams of fat and it, it, I mean, it's all vegetables, but of course, these companies, Green Giant and all the rest of these companies, they put extra stuff in there to preserve it. And they also put extra stuff in there to, to make it taste good so that you can keep coming back and buying their products over. So that's why I had so much fat um, six grams of fat, seven grams of carbs, and only two grams of protein. It was two servings in there, and two servings came out to 220 grams total. Alright, so I have this protein. This used to be my backup protein and um, I mean I'm trying to run out of it because I sell protein now on my site. Check out that site, Quovitis.fit. So I'm getting rid of that. So I drunk, drank a scoop of that. I actually drank it early in the day right after the gym. Then after that, I ate um, one of these bars. So I was just a little hungry. I actually ate it as like a dessert to my chicken and potato and vegetable get up. So one of these bars, pretty good. Um, it has 18 vitamins and minerals, blah, blah, blah. But I'm more concerned with the fat, the carbs, and the protein that it has. So fat, it has eight grams, carbs, 38, and protein, 20. So I knocked that down real quick. And then after that, I ate one serving of salmon, um, I just ate the salmon by itself, mainly because I was leaving work. I had it with me, um, and I wanted to eat it, so I ate it by itself. So now for dinner, I'm going to eat one more serving of salmon, which is 113 grams for a total of 5 grams of fat and 23 grams of protein. That's what salmon gives you. And then I'm going to eat another piece of bacon because I need some more fats. So I'm going to eat another piece of bacon, 2.5 fats, and 2 grams of protein. And then I'll eat... I'll have some of this on the side, mainly because it has a good amount of fats in it and I'm low on my fats. So four grams of fat for one serving, two grams of carbs, and less than one gram of protein. So I won't even count the protein. Um, and then, what else am I gonna have with that? Oh, two egg whites because I need more protein. Um, and egg whites, no fat, no carbs, just since it's two, it's going to be ten. If you divide two by ten, I mean, if you divide ten by two, then it's five. So five grams of protein per serving of egg white. And for a little dessert, I'm going to have this. I'm going to have some of these chocolates because I like my ice cream to have some chocolates on top. Every a lot of people like. Um, a lot of people like, you know, nuts on top or sprinkles. I like chocolates on top. I like hard chocolate. Um, that's my type of thing. And I'm going to have some of this ice cream. Just one serving. One serving will give me 7 grams of fat, 18 grams of carbohydrates, and 2 grams of protein. And then the serving size is 64 grams. So I'll have one serving of this for 64 grams. I'm going to have half a serving of this which is half a serving is, well, one serving is 15, so half a serving is about seven. If I want to be generous with myself, I'll have eight, but I'm probably going to have seven, and that'll total out to four grams of fat because I need fats, which is why I'm eating it, and then 11 grams of carbs and no protein. So for the end of the day, I went over on my fats by 0 0.1, which is good. I went over on my carbohydrates by 10.4, which is cool. And then I went over on my protein by 1.5 grams, which is a good number to hit for my proteins because I definitely want to hit proteins for muscle growth, making me look hard and feel hard. So overall on the day, I went over on my calories for 48.5 calories. So I'll go downstairs. Well, if I didn't do it earlier, because I had already did it earlier, I actually did 100 extra grams of calories because I knew I wanted some dessert at the end of the night. But um, if I didn't, then after I calculate those calories, I would go downstairs and um, run those calories off because I had no business using them in the first place. So now you know what I ate. You know what you can eat. I eat this stuff all the time. 
I look like this today and even though I'm gonna eat some ice cream more than likely I'll look like this tomorrow too you can do the same stuff I do um, stay tuned I'll keep showing you videos like this these will come out eating with me will come out at least once a week so you can see the most exciting meals I'm usually gonna just show the exciting meals um, the reason I show today is because I'm eating ice cream and pop tarts the stuff that people say you can't eat when you're on a diet quote unquote so I wanted to show you those things stay tuned next episode I'm gonna show you how you can eat a hot pocket or a lean pocket and still look great alright quovadis.fit q-u-o-v-a-d-i-s dot f-i-t follow me on Instagram Twitter Flickr Facebook all of the above Q-U-O-V-A-D-I-S-F-I-T. You see it on the screen now. Follow, support. If you support, I'll keep putting out these videos. If I don't get too many views, then um, uh, I'll stop. All right, have a good one. Bye.